guys, for the Renaissance game Contadori, we have some of the cavalry. This guy here, we'll just show him under camera, has actually got his artist with him. A common thing in the Middle Ages, artists came to paint and sketch the battle and people in the battle and occasionally the effects after the battle. But if we start here with uh, Don Juan's horse, it is what you would expect. It's got his burden on it and whatnot. It's your typical war horse of the age that you go galloping into battle, try, trying to be able to gallop back out of battle. And here we have your your hero, general, lord, or just guy with lots of money who can afford a horse, who's going to go riding into battle on the horse. And the bit I like, you have this little bit that you wouldn't realize what it is, but it actually works for this easel, which is great. I don't know if I can get the stand here at this point, but we will see it standing in the second half. Yeah. And he has his artist with him to paint him and show him in all his glory, heading off into battle in his fine horse. And he's going to go and try and kill some peasants, probably. But guys, I'm going to go and stick this all together and we'll get to see what Don Juan and his artist looks like in the second half of the video. I'll see you then, guys. Guys, I have my little lord and his artist built, and we'll get a look at him. Here we have our lord on our horse, and part of the reason that he would have had his little artist, we'll just set him aside the minute, is he'd be heading off to war. He could get captured, he could get killed if he was unlucky. He could even get caught and ransomed because killing the other people's lords weren't, wasn't particularly good for your average lord then. Basically, guys, lords went, they had a horse, things are going badly. They retreated rather quickly than the, their men on foot. If they were so unfortunate to get caught, they got ransomed back. They didn't get sold into slavery or just killed. Their teeth knocked out because somebody wanted some teeth. So, being a lord in the medieval days, Middle Ages, and going off the war on a horse was not that much of a risk. Yes, you could get killed in the fighting, but generally, no, you didn't get killed in the fighting unless you were a French at Crecy or Agincourt. You uh, didn't get killed in the fighting. You got captured. You got ransomed back, like even uh, William the Lionheart got ransomed back. Or you got on your horse and you did the very brave thing of saying, Oh no, all my peasants have broken, so I better retreat to five times as fast as them on a horse. It wasn't me, it was the men that broke. They didn't see me riding off first whenever things didn't look too badly. From my vantage point of view, sat on top of a horse. But anyway, end of rant. I do think this is a cool little thing. I do like it. I think this would be nice, sat. I stuck this guy on the big base, so he, he looks more impressive, I think, on a big base. Some of the games you play, guys, the the commanders on a horse floating around in between the ranks, they don't even have to be ranked up. They didn't do fighting as such. You know, all this, especially Warhammer Fantasy Battles, where your commander was uberly good at fighting. Generally, they sat at the back and they watched their men die. You know, who, who was it, Sid? It's a good day. We only lost 30,000 men. Hague, was it, during the First World War? S somebody won't be able to tell me uh, about it. But anyway, our Lord looks good. He's a nice big base. You get some uh, putty and stuff. You fill around this. You grass it. Look really cool. Then you get onto his little artist, his little uh, Picasso or Michelangelo of the day. I want to see somebody who actually paints the guy on the horse on this little... Uh, 
I take it it's meant to be a canvas frame on this little, I suppose in those days they didn't paint on the board as well but it was smaller generally than this. Want to see somebody with one of these with a nice painting of the guy on the horse, on his easel, on his canvas. This also looks cool. I think you could use this just by itself to sit as a piece of, in a piece of terrain at the side. At, you know where there's always artists at these battles that drew pictures of the battle and whatnot, generally after the fact. But you could stick him on a hill at the side, painting the battle as the Lord flounces around on his nice ho horse and escapes unscathed. But guys, maybe I'm being a bit sore on Lords of the Middle Ages. Maybe they were extremely brave. I don't know. I like this little set. I see lots of uses for it in game, but what do you think of it guys? Would you use this? Would you want your artist following you around, drawing heroic pictures of you if you are a general in those days? Stick your comments in below. I'll get on before I get too cynical about lords in the middle ages. I'll see you in the next one.